Hey guys, so as promised for my last video, I would make a trial of one cheese for pretty much everything excluding the stone knight. And here it is. So for starters, what you're gonna need is a campfire pit and a way to light it. Whether that be flint or discovery of fire or the flame charm talent that lets you light campfires. That's just up to you and let's get on to it. Now, for the first trial, the pairing orbs, there's not really much way to cheese it. This one is really simple. You just want to spam parry once it gets difficult, and that's pretty much it. And now, for the second trial, basically, all you want to do for this is go up to the campfire we placed earlier, and then just hug the wall once it spawns. This will lead it up there, and you'll be able to swing on it once it gets up to the ledge. And now for the third trial, which is the angels. There isn't really a great cheese for this, but I've noticed that assassinating one of the angels at the start of it makes it a lot easier. It makes it so one of them is already dead, and you only need to kill the other one. Now for the next trial, which is the golem, I'm going to go to the same ledge as before, and then wait for the golem to get near you, and you'll be able to swing it while I cannot hit you. And now the thresher is a little more difficult, as it is kind of inconsistent. Basically, I want to go where my character is in this club, and just stand on there, and whenever the thresher digs in the ground and starts to go in the animation where it's going to jump, you want to just hold space and that should prevent it from hitting you and that's pretty much it. Next up we have the Enforcer, arguably one of the easier ones to cheese. Basically all you want to do is to go to the pillar on the left of the entrance and just lead the Enforcer to get stuck there. And then once it gets stuck, go through the little crack and you'll be able to hit it and swing at it while it cannot do anything. With the stone knight, there is no real method to cheese it. All you need to do is only attack it twice and make sure you use your roll as much as possible. Now with the second pairing orbs, it's just as easy as the first. All you need to do is as soon as the text disappears, you just want to spam F. Now with the final trial, all I want to do is just spam F whenever the orbs pop up, and then during the duration when they're not shooting at you, you want to swing at the Sharko. And there you go guys, that's the full trial of one cheese. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, feel free to like and subscribe and check out some of my other videos. Thanks for watching.